fact. <laughs> You're like filming out the window. Look at all the gravestones. Yeah, beautiful. It's fun. That's, I want to be there. Yeah, that's a theme. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to A Day in My Life, the only series of vlogs on the internet where I, I do things. My name is Derek, I'll be your guide, and today me and my friend Pasty are gonna go visit my friend Gerber at college. But during the car ride, I thought it would be good to get to know my friend Pasty a little bit better. So since we're gonna be on this awesome road trip together, I devised some would you rather questions. And by devised, I mean I looked them up on Google. Great, wonderful. And you know, I want to get to know you better uh -huh. because you're my friend. Yes. So I'm going to ask you some questions. Wonderful. Okay. Question number one. What's would your you... social security number? <laughs> All right. Question number one. Would you rather lose your sex organs forever or gain 200 pounds for the rest of your life? Uh, starting off with the easy ones, I see. Yes. Uh, definitely it would probably have to be gain 200 pounds. I mean, yeah, it would suck to weigh almost 400 pounds, but... Your boy need a penis. I, I do need one of those, fun fact. <laughs> I mean, if I weighed that much, I mean, I, at least I could pursue a career of computer hacking and uh, harassing women online. Yeah, so. fedora wearing. <laughs> fedora wearing. Would you rather have no penis or five penises? Where are you getting these, why are so many penis related questions? I'm getting it from thoughtcatalog.com. Let me get some more questions. You looked up two questions in that whole time? No, the other ones are shitty. <laughs> the other ones are like, oh, oh, would you rather hang out with your best friend or would you rather shoot yourself in the fucking face? Easy, I shoot myself in the face. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm looking up funny conversation starters. Like, for instance, um, what is the sexiest last name? <laughs> what? Did, was that the end of the question? Yep. What? what is the sexiest last name? The sexiest last name. I Probably I'd have to say something along the lines of maybe like Gert. If animals could talk, which would be the rudest? That's a good question. I'd probably have to say, you know, I'd probably have to say Chihuahuas because they just look like a bitch. Like, I just, Plus, I, one time a Chihuahua was voiced by George Lopez, so you really hit the bottom of the barrel there. Have you ever seen Beverly Hills Chihuahua? <laughs> yeah, I saw Beverly Hills Chihuahua too as well. <laughs> did you ever binge both of them in one sitting like I did? No, I'm not that big of a masochist. Do you want I... to? <laughs> yeah, let's do it right now. Hold on here. Let me pull it up on my <laughs> Let me pull out my like early 2007 DVD player. <laughs> yeah, one of the portable ones with like a three inch screen. You just stick it on the dashboard while you're driving. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. What is the most embarrassing thing you have ever worn? I thought that said the most embarrassing thing you've ever won, and I could probably say that time that I beat a bunch of kids in Smash Bros. And Dude, like that was so much fun to watch you. Oh my god, you were like shitting on seven-year-olds. Those kids were probably like, Mommy, why do you hate me so much? As a quick expl <laughs> explanation, we went to we went to a video game con, which is literally called... That, that, like, that's the name yeah, of the, the another convention. Another video game con. <laughs> But I went there, and they had a Smash Bros. tournament, and I entered, and I had to beat a bunch of kids to progress, and no, no kids gonna beat me in video games, so I just ended up beating the shit out of them in the game until, like, one of them kind of got a little bit sad and a little cr cry, but it's fine, because I taught them a valuable lesson that you're going to get your ass kicked in life, and no one cares about you. We're about to go on to a roundabout. Look, see? A roundabout? Yeah, the, the, yeah, that, that's, that's what this is called. No, I'm not referencing the goddamn JoJo music. The fucking troglodyte. As you can see, we're literally driving in the middle of... Literally, literally driving in the middle of nowhere We right are now. literally driving. Okay, next question. What's the funniest joke you know by heart? The funniest and joke? And it can't be a shitty, like, JPEG meme. 
Because that's not a joke. <laughs> what do that's you mean? That's a stupid image. What do you mean that's not a joke? Your taste in jokes is garbage, and we were arguing about this yesterday. You don't like bass boosted or surreal memes, and... That, I'm, I'm fine just, with bass mm, boosted or surreal memes. Nah, just, nah, I, nah, I'm nah. sick of them being overused uh -huh. and shitty. Yeah. Uh -huh. Because people think if you just look at bass boost something, it's, it's funny. It is. It's it not is. funny. It's inherently, if you manage to bass boost, like, a speech by fucking, you know, FDR, one of his fireside chats bass boosted, I would lose my shit at that. Because it's inherently funny. You're garbage. I'm not garbage. You're absolute fucking garbage. Nah, nah, no. Your humor is just down the shitter. You've evolved past normal human senses of humor. Okay, I do agree with you on that. I just want to go back to being able to enjoy a Medea movie. Uh, well, you know, considering Boo, a Medea Halloween, is probably one of the greatest cinematic masterpieces of... Uh, this millennium. No, I personally think that Boo 2 and Medea Halloween 2 uh, was probably like way better than the first. Most because likely, it had, had yeah. Foozy Tube in it. It did. It had Foozy Tube in it? So, like, I had people who support me online go see it like three times and say they laughed harder each time. Hush, I'm trying to be in Cockerico. In Cockerico? Shut Yes, that's We right. ain't going to no in Cockerico this weekend. Damn, hush. Oh, they laughed harder each time. Pasty, what's your favorite type of tree? My favorite type of tree? Um, I mean, I really like sakura blossoms, but I probably have to say Japanese maple. I had them growing up on, on in my yard while I was little. And the, the fact that they have those seed pods that when they drop, they, they spin around the little helicopter seed pods, I always thought was really interesting. How are you a weeb even when it comes to trees? How, how is that a weeb answer? It's a sakura goddamn tree. Sakura blossoms? Well, yeah, the they Japanese... They grow in Japan, pasty. No, actually, J Japan in like 1908 gifted the United States all of the Japanese uh, mm -hmm. cherry trees in Washington, D.C. You know that what Japan the also world. gifted us, pasty? You don't want to know what we get? Anime! Yeah, they you... gifted us anime! What is the absolute worst name that you could give your child? The absolute worst name that I could give my child? Why do I feel like you'd name your child something fucking stupid like Dr. Phil Eminem Jr.? <laughs> no, how dare you? What do you mean, Jr.? That's implying my name is Dr. Phil. I can never take God's name in vain. No, like, that's in his name. The Jr. is a part of the name. <laughs> <laughs> so everybody's like, oh, your na your dad's name is Dr. Phil. And he's like, no, he just fucking hates me. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, you know, part of me, <laughs> part of me really wants to name my kid Jeff. So only people that were alive in like 2016 actually understand. So every time, every time my child introduces himself, you know, he says, oh, what's your name? My name's Jeff. My name is Jeff. They laughed harder each time. Hey, look, it's a shithead. Hey, I'm getting in a car with a bunch of white guys. This never turns out well. Yo, what's up, gamers? Please turn off the camera. No. I'll break your fucking camera. So what's your address? All right, here are the exact latitude and longitude coordinates on your screen right now for where Gerber's exact bed is. So uh, if you want to find him, he'll be there. We'll uh, cook him some nice uh, cookies for you. And, uh, I actually love to make cookies, so yeah, I'll make cookies. What's your favorite part about your college campus, Gerber? This, this absolutely great long walk every day. Your calves must be thick as hell, boy. You'll see, I, I'm wearing shorts. Oh. Underneath, underneath the, the, the pants. <laughs> My favorite Family Guy moment is when Peter fights the chicken, and it makes me laugh every time. I hate you. I'm not going to invite you anymore. You can go home. I understand the Fighters Guild is hiring new members. Not bad work for some folks. Say something funny. Uh... Y'all got any toes? They laughed harder each time. What if Review Bra was your father? This is running on empty. Food review. Well, I mean, his body is lanky like a 15 year old, but the way he dresses and acts is like a wizened 50 year old. So I think he'd be a very good father. What about you, Gerber? I'd be able to, to know the ingredients of every food without even looking at it. <laughs> what? Yeah, like, the, the images just appear inside of your eyes. You know the give of the, the numbers flying around you? It's me, but with like food. Can you edit that in? Like food ingredients just flying around my head. What if like you do something bad as a kid and he walks into your room and he grounds you and he's like, listen, Gerber, my son, 
My disappointment <laughs> is immeasurable. And my day is ruined. <laughs> oh shoot, did I mention that we're here to watch Gerber's fencing match? Oh yeah, so this is a new thing. Gerber fences now. I'm guessing that he played Marth or really any Fire Emblem character in Smash and was just like, yeah, I could do that. So yeah, we're watching him poke a sword into other people's bodies today. Will I get to see you stab somebody yes. in the heart and rip it out and like just Eat it. probably yep. not that. But like less so. Look at so this man's face. legs. Look at the top of his head. This Kong has a funny face. I hate you. <laughs> Do you think that they call it fencing because they make the fences and it, it like it's it's competitive? Let me rephrase that. Do you think? Do you think? Your fucking face makes me <laughs> laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think they call it fencing because they're like competitively trying to make a fence and it's like a time thing and whoever makes the fence first wins? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's exactly like that. Ah shoot! I forgot to tell my dad I was leaving today. Let me just call him up real quick. Hello? Hey dad, uh, I forgot to tell you earlier today that I was visiting my friend's college. Uh, is that, That's okay, right? I don't give a shit! Where do you go, as long as it's away from this house, you disappointment? <laughs> uh, okay, cool. <sighs> you took your vitamins this morning, didn't you? The Flintstone chewable ones? Yep, yeah, I did. Okay, good. Hate you, son. <laughs> I love my dad. Yo, are you John Pierre Polnareff from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? <laughs> oh, fuck! Ow! Good luck, Gerber. You're gonna freaking need it. Surprise it. All right. Don't let him psych you out. Wiggle your stick harder. <laughs> oh! Oh shit! If this keeps up, Gerber's going straight to the shadow room. Nice, Gerber. Oh no! He's bringing out his true stance. Oh no! He's trying to intimidate you with his size. Hey, look! There's a horse over there. <laughs> oh my god, it worked! Golf clap, everyone. Golf clap. He out memed you, dude. Yeah. Just give he out memed me. <laughs> <laughs> they laughed harder each time.